we observe the globe, it will be evident that the mainland of India and its islands are to the north of the equator. It is also on the eastern side of the Greenwich Meridian. It means India is located in the northern and the eastern hemispheres. India has a central position in the southern part of the Asian continent. The Tropic of Cancer passes through the central part of India. India's latitudinal extent is from 8 degrees 4 minutes 28 seconds north to 37 degrees 6 minutes 53 seconds north, which makes it 29 degrees 2 minutes 35 seconds. However, the southernmost tip of India is located at 6 degrees 45 minutes north latitude. This point is in Andaman and Nicobar Islands and is known as Indira Point. The latitudinal extent has an impact on the rainfall, temperature and duration of days and nights of a place. Let us see its impact on the duration of days and nights of a place. As we know that the length of a day and night varies throughout the year. This variation is caused by the tilt of the Earth's axis of rotation around the Sun. For example, the difference between the longest and the shortest day near Kanyakumari is about 15 minutes, whereas this difference is nearly 4 hours in Leh and Ladakh. The longitudinal extent of India is from 68 degrees 7 minutes 33 seconds east to 97 degrees 24 minutes 47 seconds east which makes it 29 degrees 17 minutes 14 seconds. The longitudinal extent helps in determining the local time, sunrise, sunset etc. Although India is a big country, we cannot follow different time in each city. For example, the difference between the sunrise at Kibithu village in Arunachal Pradesh and that of Gaur Mota near Sir Creek in Gujarat is about 116 minutes. The meridian of longitude 82 degrees 30 minutes east which passes close to Allahabad is our standard meridian and Indian Standard Time or IST is fixed as per this local time. This time is followed throughout the country.